In this video, let us look into the microscopic features of parathyroid gland. I am grateful to Dr. Michael Horsch of University of Michigan Medical School for providing me with these histology sections. Parathyroid glands are two pairs of small yellowish brown oval structures which are present along the posterior border of the lobes of thyroid gland. They are present between the true and false capsules of thyroid gland. In this section, we can see the section of parathyroid gland adjacent to thyroid gland. Parathyroid gland is covered by a delicate capsule. Although this capsule sends in septae, distinct well-defined lobules are not seen in the parathyroid gland parenchyma. After puberty, adipose tissue begins to accumulate in the stroma of the gland. Amount of adipose tissue keeps increasing with the age occupying almost two-third of the glandular mass beyond the middle age. Parenchyma shows cords of cells and like any other endocrine gland, connective tissue stroma shows fenestrated capillaries. Two types of cells are seen in parathyroid gland, principal cells or chief cells and oxyphil cells. Principal cells are the most numerous there are, these are small polygonal pale staining clear cells with a central nucleus. Cytoplasm contains lipofusin vesicles, lipid droplets and abundant glycogen granules. These cells secrete parathyroid hormone which helps in calcium metabolism. Oxyphil cells on the contrary are less numerous but their number increases with age. They may be found singly or they may be found in clusters as seen here. They are larger cells, round in shape with distinctly eosinophilic cytoplasm due to abundant mitochondria. Their function is currently not very well known. So quickly recollecting what we have seen, two pairs of parathyroid glands are located along the posterior border of the thyroid lobes. Each parathyroid gland is covered by a delicate capsule which sends in septae but the gland is divided into indistinct lobules. Two types of cells are found in parathyroid gland, principal cells which secrete parathyroid hormone and oxyphil cells of unknown function. Connective tissue stroma shows increasing amounts of adipose tissue with age as well as fenestrated capillaries. Thank you. Hope you found this video useful. You can also visit this site for similar histology videos.